to create this environment, uh, to build this collaborative world and uh, to enable information workers to have access securely to music or other information that they prefer to use. Do we give up on standardisation of devices at all and accept that uh, that's not the game in town? I, I prefer the, the less sexy stuff, actually. I think organisations would do well. Uh, you've talked about what Adobe does internally, yeah. um, having a focus on productivity. I would like to see organisations say, we're going to look at information worker productivity and see what we can do about it. And that could be something really fabulous and new and it could be some really interesting stuff around bring your own tablet or it could just be something actually that's quite boring about making it easier to share information, making it easier to collect feedback. I'm always interested in what are people actually doing and you know everybody is not an early adopter. Some people are, and often the guy who's brought his iPhone 5 in, particularly if he's important, is the one getting all the attention and the one getting all IT working and worrying about what they can do. What about the people who are just trying to do their job, and if they can do it in a more efficient way, then their creativity and their insight and perhaps their long knowledge of the business can actually be turned to some value instead of wrestling with the technology. So that would be my, my key takeaway. Focus on productivity and look at what your users really need you to do. IT needs to ensure the security and the management of the documents is 100% taken care of so that that doesn't become a part of the information workers' problem. Um, so they need to work hand in hand, um, but very much have those tools to be able to share that information. IT needs to evolve needs to evolve um, to move from the technology-centric uh, thinking to more of um, uh, motivating, enabling uh, kind of um, dimension. I think also most particularly, I may be biased on this, but I think from what I've seen in many organizations is that uh, standardization is uh, cut across the board, but we think that um, standardization should be looked at from the point of um, culture also. Mm -hmm. uh, we see, for example, where I come from, it's unbelievable that uh, mobile talk time is the highest in the world in East Africa. Mm -hmm. So if we have mobile offices and mobile networks uh, that link uh, East Africa with, uh, with our organization, then we need to take that into consideration that there's plenty of talk time there, we need to adjust in how we look at sanitization. And then the lastly is to urge um, IT practitioners to focus now more on trust. Uh, I've seen that um, help us a great deal within the organization, especially an organization full of lawyers. Uh, one of the things that you don't want to come out as an expert of IT issues if you come out of the next part of IT issues, you get opposition, and we'll see this coming out through. So I see that uh, IT practitioners need to go back to the basics and build focus on trust. If they can build trust within the organization, then they will go along as a journey, as partners, throughout this um, uh, journey of um, uh, digital world place, if you like, or the position for, for, for the IT people is, is actually as facilitators, um, you know, putting in place the, um, the, uh, the tools, the technologies, the platforms, or whatever it is that are needed to move the business forward. Um, and I think the key thing that comes out, or well, one of the key things for me that comes out of the uh, research that IDC did is around, you know, if you make or allow, not even make, but allow um, workers to be more efficient in what they do, that's where your cost savings start coming in and that's what pays for the infrastructure changes that they need. You know, making people more efficient or allowing people to be more efficient in the way that they work um, will effectively fund the infrastructure that people need to put in place mm. or need to adjust in many places organisations, I see the infrastructure is already there, it's just making the, the tools available to people to actually take advantage of what's already there.